We start from the beginning then. This video is about Arbioscope, which is a weekly event that happens on Wednesdays and started eight months ago. The cool thing about the venue Ao is that you have space to do your own thing, freedom to act on your own with support from Ao's crew when needed. They have created a great environment to produce, exhibit and create art projects. Since Ao's program already featured exhibitions, live concerts, literature readings and art performances, Kino was a logical involvement to make it more complete. The initial goal of Bioscope was to present movies outside the mainstream border, something that is more experimental, unknown or obscure, that fits our aesthetics, with content hard to find in most common places. You need some knowledge about underground movies to be familiar with the titles projected in this one-month Bioscope special. It is a no-effort gig for the attendants, where the only effort needed is just coming here. The idea to evolve came after a conversation with Mickey about the concept of it. The decision was to have live sets for the projected films. This plan came forth when Van Monte arrived back from Berlin. Since he's a close friend and I believe in his work, I invited him for the first event. We didn't have much time. Time was always a difficult thing to handle. But not having much time ended up helping us too. It was the lack of it that made us start editing the movies. I spoke with Van Monte three days before the event, and he accepted the invitation. I thought about getting some footage that would be easy for him to play over, so I ended up picking up Stan Brackage films. We went to my friend Ivo, who would edit it, and in the process we chose the parts that would look exciting, but also fit Van Monte's sound. That's how the crew got together, me, Van Monte and Ivo. The idea was to start with uh, Van Monte and in the process of upcoming weeks continue with different musicians. Since all three of us were happy with the result, we decided to keep it going and organize a second week with the Anaconda Boy. The second week gave place to a third week, which led to a fourth week. How, how big is this, you know? I need to put this kind of stuff. No, they, they don't put in the video. <laughs> Okay, one more. Open it, yeah, that's oh, it. Just open it. Then the same shit, man. And then come with a, a video that with four effects and the shit, you know? No, man. Hey, some, some, some battle rock, my t-shirt. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nice to have a Hey, mister. How are you? <laughs> some some somebody take my t-shirt. <laughs> really? Yeah, yeah. there. The problem, buddy. Village pig. That's a really big problem, you know. <laughs> Before he was two times jail, you know. Some he fuck mama, sister. Problems. So now I have a new method how to make these bands. You know? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, just tell me and I'm ready. Uh -huh. Anyway, this is what happened on our first event. <laughs>
This is the second week. The choice for this, this week was Ken Jacobs' Tom Tom the Piper Son. This movie was too long for a live set, but it ended up working pretty well. <laughs> In the third week, we used the uh, Institute Benjamin by the Quai Brothers. It had a pretty nice flow, but the concept was the same as the previous one. <laughs>
Well, basically, it was all the same again, so we felt the need to keep evolving. There was a week gap between the third and fourth event where Van Monte spent some time in the hospital and his computer broke down. We ended up profiting from his tough luck. We had more time to prepare, which was always the main pressure factor. In this one, I used the Emperor Automatic Ketchup Cycle. In the end, there was one more performer joining the, the show, Mickey, the drummer from Nicaragua, as Tomato named him. Well, they did a 15-minute uh, sound check and the uh, show was on. Play, play, press play, press play. Yeah, nice, nice. Sorry, I didn't see it. Talk inside. Sorry? It started. Yeah, it started. Yeah. 
I don't have to say sorry to you, but we weren't testing, okay? <laughs> don't worry. <laughs> this was my friend from Nicaragua. It's really sighty because it's the first time here in Vienna.